While Meta is still dealing with tough questions and some pushback about its latest Llama 4 models, NVIDIA, known for being a big name in GPU technology, quietly made a huge move. They introduced a brand new, completely open large language model, and it's already turning heads. What's even more interesting is that this powerful AI was built using Meta's older model, the Llama 3.1405B Instruct. Yet despite using an older base, NVIDIA's model is showing off some seriously impressive skills, even beating one of its strongest competitors, the highly praised DeepSeek R1, in several trusted AI performance tests. This shiny new creation goes by the name Llama 3.1 Nematron Ultra 253 BV1. That name may sound like a mouthful, but what's inside it is even more incredible. It's packed with a jaw-dropping 253 billion parameters, which basically means it's equipped with a brain big enough to understand, reason, follow directions, and help out like a real assistant. This isn't just any model. It's been carefully designed to handle extremely complex thinking tasks, make smart decisions, and respond to instructions in a way that feels natural and useful. People first got a sneak peek of this model during NVIDIA's big GPU technology conference in March, but now the wait is over. On the night of April 7, 2025, NVIDIA finally made it official and gave the world access to this powerful tool. And they didn't hold anything back. They've made everything about the model public. Right from the code to the weights it was trained with, and even the data used after training to make it sharper and more polished. All of this has been uploaded to Hugging Face, a beloved platform where developers from all over the globe share and explore AI models. This move shows NVIDIA's serious commitment to sharing their work and helping others build upon it. But the real magic of this model is in how it works. NVIDIA made sure it could switch between two different types of behavior. When needed, the model can go into a deep thinking mode, solving tricky problems and carrying out detailed instructions. But if you want something simpler, like casual answers or quick suggestions, it can tone things down too. Think of it like a light switch for the brain, where you get to choose between serious brain power or relaxed responses based on what the system tells it to do. This makes it super flexible, perfect for everything from research to regular conversations. What this really shows is how deeply NVIDIA cares about making their models not just stronger, but smarter. They didn't just throw in more parameters and call it a day. They worked hard to build a better structure inside the model and added special touches after training to help it think more clearly and work more smoothly. To get a better understanding on how this model was designed, you need to keep watching. How NVIDIA built its new AI model, NVIDIA's latest creation, the Llama 3.1 Nematron Ultra 253B, is not something that just appeared out of the blue. It's actually the next step in NVIDIA's ongoing journey to make large language models run better and faster, especially when it comes to how they process information. This model takes everything NVIDIA has learned so far and builds on it in a smarter, more thoughtful way. To make this model even more powerful, NVIDIA used something called Neural Architecture Search. It's a clever technique that helps design better model structures by trying out many different options and picking the best ones. Thanks to this process, the new model comes with some exciting changes under the hood. Instead of sticking to the same old layout, NVIDIA added unique features like skipping some attention layers when they're not needed, blending parts of the brain called feed-forward networks to work more smoothly together, and adjusting how these parts are compressed to save space and time. All these upgrades have a big impact. They help the model use less memory and require fewer computing resources which is a huge win. And here's the amazing part, it still delivers really good results. So you're getting strong performance without the heavy cost that usually comes with running such a big AI. This smart design even makes it possible to run the model on a single machine with eight H100 GPUs, which used to be nearly impossible for something this size. But Nvidia didn't stop there. They also made sure that the model works well with other hardware too. That includes their newer B100 chips and the impressive Hopper microarchitectures. On top of that, they've tested the model in two different formats, BF16 and FP8, to make sure it's flexible and ready for different kinds of systems and setups. 
This makes the model a great fit not only for tech experts in data centers, but also for anyone looking for cost-effective, high-performing AI tools. Fine-tuned for perfection. NVIDIA didn't just stop at building a strong foundation for its Llama 3.1 Nemetron Ultra 253B model. They went the extra mile to fine-tune it with great care and intention. The company put this model through several thoughtful stages after its initial training, making sure it wasn't just smart, but also well-behaved, sharp, and full of useful knowledge. The first step in this extra training journey involved teaching the model in a supervised way, kind of like a student being guided by a teacher. NVIDIA trained it on various types of tasks so it could understand a wide range of topics. These included solving math problems, writing computer code, holding conversations like a chatbot, and even using digital tools. This stage helped the model learn how to follow instructions and stay focused, no matter what kind of job it was doing. Then came another powerful step, reinforcement learning. NVIDIA used a special method called group relative policy optimization. It might sound technical, but in simple terms, it's a way to reward the model when it performs well, especially in understanding and following instructions or thinking through complex problems. This method helped the model sharpen its thinking and make better decisions in response to prompts. But the learning didn't end there. NVIDIA also used a technique called knowledge distillation. Imagine having a super smart teacher whispering all the right answers into the model's ear as it reads through a massive 65 billion words. That's pretty much what happened. This step made sure the model absorbed high quality information in a way that stuck. After that, they continued feeding it more data like another 88 billion words to be exact, so it could keep learning and growing even smarter. The information used to teach the model came from a rich mix of sources. NVIDIA picked datasets like FineWeb, BuzzV 1.2, and Dolma, each filled with valuable and several content. When it came time to practice and polish the model's final responses, NVIDIA used a combination of real-world data and creatively generated samples. They even used special sets of questions and answers designed to help the model understand when it should be in deep thinking mode or when a simpler answer would do. That clever detail made it even more adaptable and user-friendly. Altogether, this careful step-by-step post-training process turned the Llama 3.1 Nemetron Ultra 253B into something truly special. It wasn't just about piling on more data or making it faster. It was about creating a model that could think, respond, and assist in ways that feel natural and helpful. NVIDIA's thoughtful work behind the scenes brought this AI to life in the sweetest, smartest way possible. Now let's see how it proved itself to the competitors. Outperforming competitors. NVIDIA's brand new Llama 3.1 Nemetron Ultra 253B is already turning heads with how smart and flexible it can be especially when it's allowed to switch into what's called its reasoning mode. That's basically the model's superpower switch. When turned on, it thinks harder, solves problems better, and gives even more impressive results. Let's talk numbers, because these are not just small wins. On a challenging test known as Math 500, the model managed to go from a decent 80.40% to a jaw-dropping 97% just by flipping on its advanced reasoning feature. And it wasn't just a one-time lucky shot, because on the AIME 25 test, which is another big math-based challenge, the model's performance climbed from a modest 16.67% all the way up to 72.50%. That's like going from almost failing to nearly mastering it. Then there's Live Code Bench, a coding task test, where the score more than doubled, leaping from 29.3% to a solid 66.3%. These are the kinds of improvements that show just how powerful this model becomes when it's really allowed to stretch its brain. And the magic didn't stop there. The model also stood out in more tool-based problem-solving tests like BFCLV2 and function composition, where the goal is to handle tricky, multi-step tasks. Even on a general knowledge challenge called GPQA, it performed way better with reasoning turned on scoring 76.1% compared to just 56.60% when the feature was off. To make sure all of these test results were accurate and fair, NVIDIA ran each evaluation several times, up to 16 repeats in some cases, using input sequences as long as 32,000 tokens. That's a lot of data being processed, 
proving how serious they were about getting honest results. Now, when compared to another popular open source model called DeepSeek R1, which has a whopping 671 billion parameters, NVIDIA's new creation still shines. Even though it has less than half the parameters, it goes toe-to-toe -to -toe with DeepSeek R1 on many tasks and even beats it in some key areas. For instance, it scored higher in GPQA, performed better in following instructions on the EFEVIL test, and edged past in coding skills on Live Code Bench. Of course, DeepSeek R1 still has a bit of an edge when it comes to some math-heavy tasks. It scored a bit higher on Amy 25 and just barely beat NVIDIA's model on Math 500. But calculating it all round, NVIDIA's model proves that it doesn't need a mountain of parameters to be smart. It's leaner, faster, and still incredibly capable. If you've made it this far, let us know what you think in the comment section below. For more interesting topics, make sure you watch the recommended video that you see on the screen right now. Thanks for watching.